fantastic wife. Not Edna? Not even remotely. Come on. And you're in the Jeez. <laughs> married to God, Mary Steenburgen, for God's sake. Anywhere in time, <laughs> you're the luckiest guy in the universe. There are no miserable people in my Hill Valley. Give me a break. You don't really believe. My citizens lead lives of order and peace. It's a nice little turnaround for his character. Yeah, yeah Marty just went one step too far. You and Edna have got him all terrorized. That's Mrs. Brown to you. Oh, nice shot of the uh, American Gothic. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we had, we had fun with the art in the background. We worked for over 50 years, my wife and I. Every waking moment devoted to Riddy Hill Valley. So who did this set? Oh, this is all Dennis. That's... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I do. I've seen it. They're just Brian Gilly's model with Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I, I love the uh, yeah. the clock and the books on the desk. The yeah. How they make a miniature version. Of, yes. We just wanted that model. Originally had this plan for the same model that he always builds, Doc. That is inside of his office. That's sort of like he would he'd be able to track all the citizens of Hill Valley on this little map. Oh no. And another knocked out senior McFly. Whacked me. Eating the peanut brittle. Physical violence in Hill Valley have fallen to virtually ah. We regress. Can you tell me? We regress George to back to his earlier peeping Tom days. And his peanut brittle days. Yeah. Yeah, I really like that aspect where. But it can't be him. George and Lorraine in particular have gone back to not just how we knew them in the first film, but a, an amplified, bad version of it. Yeah, with a, yeah, it's, with, in, in the nanny state, they never really grow up. Well, down there, fella. You beat up my dad. Now let's see if we can get to the bottom of this. Yeah. Let's. I can't hurt anybody. Thanks to Citizen. Of course, Biff never really grows up in any reality, though. <laughs> <No. laughs> yeah. Recording the deaf lines were also a lot of fun, um, especially when they would kind of come out of order and we'd have to switch between, all right, now you're nice, Biff. Okay, now you're mean, Biff. Okay, now you're back. And just <laughs> yeah. um, actually switching back and forth yeah. line to line uh, was a little weird. But Okay, uh, that's weird. <laughs> but Kid Beyond yeah, is, my dad's tape. I think he totally uh, did a great job at at doing that character and, hey, Mr. Tin. and both variations of it in this episode. Uh, 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 <laughs> There's some fun this physical comedy here. This is a preview here. of uh, our <laughs> Walking <going> Dead game. <laughs> 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 Biff wants brains. <laughs> This just always reminds me of uh, oh. Willy Wonka. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. Holy smokes. W w what happened to him? I don't know. Well, here goes nothing. He was a bad egg. <laughs> Gosh, man, did I do something wrong? So this is a fun space. It's, it's it, it calls back to the, uh, of course, the speakeasy. But then also, if you kind of notice, it's set up very similar to Edna's original apartment. The last thing I remember. Instead of a instead of a bay window to look out, she's got all those monitors to look at. I'm down here, and you're yelling at me. McFly. <laughs> There was banana canister there in case anybody uh, thought I saw that. Uh, Strictly. <laughs> oh, hi, Martin. <laughs> Give me He's the getting the extra high, Marty. <laughs> this is a fun room to populate. I wish we could have put more cool 80s things to ban, fun 80s things to ban <laughs> into this room, but it, it has some clever stuff if you really look around, even some callbacks to the movies. Those your favorite cigars? Cubans. So wow. yes, you've got to get Biff Cannon. to look at Listen to me. cigars, booze, and porn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, she looks pleased with that. <laughs> Hit him again. That'll work. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> Tannin! Get up, you useless slacker! Come on, Edna, give the poor jerk a break. <laughs> she was supposed to Don't kick him at us. some point. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just couldn't work out the staging of yeah. <laughs> getting her to cover that much distance. Is distractible as my husband's. No. No! Edna! 
Doc? Busted. Ellis, yeah. What are you doing here? I came down here to investigate a troubling report involving Mr. Tan. Doc, you gotta stop her. She. Silence! Okay. And now Marty will go away for the arrest of. Then <laughs> <laughs> quietly off to the side. When I found my wife perverting my life's work. Is this what it's all been about, Edna? All those years? All our struggles to cure the, the first time I read the script, this scene and or this this cutscene in particular and the whole scene in Citizen Brown's office were the two that you just totally just sold me on. As I did. Okay, yes. Remember? If and, uh, only we could tell someone to stay Lloyd off just the grass and the, uh, still help us, they the would never tread foot on a well-managed yeah. yeah. again. Yeah. That's what Citizen Plus does. He's been through does. it. He's been through it. Wow. of changes. <laughs> we will not have this discussion here. But Go home and wait for me. How Fine. Doc Brown got his groove back. <laughs> the bold yellow font of girly, the girly mag. mag. I know. I keep noticing that too. <laughs> if we could just go back and fix one thing. <laughs> what? Whoa. We resisted the con. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the first time ever. Marty, game. Marty had the wrath of con. Oh, he did. Yeah, at the beginning yeah. of the game. So oh, we only get one of those for episodes. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of empty pages. The only one you need is right here. And this was this was a neat uh, thing where we Eric was calling out all the uh, instances of of the flux capacitor symbol. We had a fun time designing the logo for yeah. for the city too. It's it's a, what I like about it is it's like at first it, it was clearly uh, a victory pose with the arms outstretched, but as I looked at it and looked at it and was writing the script, it, it started to turn into someone shackled up in a gulag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this all kind of spun out of something that, you know, very early in the process, we noticed something. We noticed that the park in Hill Valley was a flux right. capacitor symbol and it had been there all along. <laughs> and it makes no sense that it is, but that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> no, just some production designer back in the first film. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it really set the bar. Now we had to be that clever. Be furious, but who cares? We've got a time machine to fix. And it does also, it's the, the Back to the Future eternal theme that nobody really changes. Everybody is, is uh, they either realize their true selves or they don't, but they're, uh, they've always got it inside them. Yeah, and it's the notion that uh, to some, at some level, the idea for the flux capacitor is still in his head. Uh, just kind of gurgling in subconscious, waiting for the right moment. Because all I remember is a punk kid who thought it'd be funny to make me jump down a... Remember when this scene had lawn darts? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, what, the lawn darts were cut? Yeah, we cut the lawn darts. Oh. Yes, I do remember Please the lawn bets. darts. What the... Hey, it's almost like we planned that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out of here, Andy. Einstein's like, yep, he's dead. <laughs> 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 <Can I hit him? laughs> Because I'm the evil twin Einstein. I eat people, you know. <laughs> Sorry I took so long. Biff came around and jumped me. I so the happy ending. Yeah. Yeah. Again, everything's fine. Whoa, wait, what? Oh, oh, man. oh, oh man. man. You never trust a, a high-backed <laughs> chair <laughs> turned away yeah. from you. Ruined in just a few short hours. Where's Doc? Uh, Doc. My husband is in a better place. She's nice. dead? <laughs> oh. No, no. Oops. Oh, oh, no. Right. <laughs> We've got everything yeah. under faceless guards. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, what's gonna happen? She's gonna lick the screen. <laughs> <laughs> That's creepy. Uh, well, and now stay tuned for uh, episode four. Commentary. Commentary. <laughs> Thanks for playing. Of, uh, uh, Back, Back to the, the future. future. Yeah.